Looks we like got Cosmos coming up! Hi! Oh <laughs> snap. That's it. We are ready. We are ready for this. And we need it. Oh, it's Cosmos versus Jeb. Okay. It's going to be interesting because we're What in a great name, Jeb. Straight to the point. Jeb. My name is Jeb. That's it. <laughs> Get some, Jeb! That's it. That's it. That's it. Get some. Alright, so. We're going to have to see how this works. The Cosmos can put it in work, hasn't he? Cosmos is godlike. He's uh, considered to be one of the best Korans in the world. See? Actually. Um, so it's kind of like Baylor versus Korin. Yeah, he originally oh. resided from uh, Texas, I think. Yes. And then is he, he moved to the Leap of Faith, the Loft House, is that right? If in I, uh, Northeast? Yes, I think correctly. Love the TO shirt right now. No <laughs> items, spots only, final destination. <laughs> and we're hopping right into it. <laughs> See that they're, they're strut, ready. that they're Bayo hungry. strut, exuding that confidence. Jeb has That's every it. right to be confident. Uh, Jeb's been putting in work as well, uh, but I feel like Cosmos so. definitely has some knowledge against the Bayo. <laughs> I wonder, he always said after that down throw, he goes for back air. I wonder if um, they DI a certain way, if it, if it connects. I think it should. Uh, a I lot will. of times, something like that does. Oh, and he's still that was, going. That was nice. And that's just like a frame trap. And Corbin's got frame traps of her own, let me tell you. Oh, yeah. See, we always talk about Bayo shenanigans, but we never really talk what about the corn shenanigans yeah. that you can be played here. Let's see. Two, the two Look newest characters. That's true. Let's see. Uh, my corn is definitely one of my the fun ones I like playing as. Oh, yeah, corn's great. My old main used to be Robin, so let's see. I love uh, Fire, Fire Emblem. Fire Emblem. Emblem Fire, Fire Emblem. Let's see. How do you like the new one? Uh, so far, um, I've been watching one of my buddies play it because, um, unfortunately, no, my 3DS is no longer. Let's You know, what? you're like literally the third person that's told me that. It's no longer. Did you get me. it in like uh, 2011 or something, <laughs> and then it's just lost? Ooh. And Ooh. That was that, that up air is all so large and so safe. It's just like That's goodbye. It. <laughs> um, but yeah, I got it real early. Um, played a lot of it. Played uh, a lot of Fire Emblem. A lot That's of it. Fire Emblem. Um, I actually played the one with Corrin. Oh and, yeah. And I love Fate. Fire Emblem Fate was fantastic. Yep. The new one. From the new I've one. Seen, the new one's fantastic. fun, dude. The um, maps are great on it. Oh yeah. Um, and the voice acting. It's all voice acting, all the words, See, completely, it, and it's it, good voice acting. Woo! And gets the, the tip. tip. Woo! Cosmos is not playing around. He's like, you're gonna get this tip. You're gonna feel it. <laughs> <laughs> That's all she can handle. <laughs> <laughs> That's all. That's all. That's all she can do. <laughs> That's I mean, as you saw, Bayo Bea literally went flying because of it. <laughs> That's all she could do. Oh, and there and it is again. again. And that tip, just Bayo is not ready that. She just gets no. overwhelmed, and man. she's <laughs> out of here. That's Cosmo's it. putting in work, and I feel like Cosmo's is just He's doing so good at that, so those good tips. At tip. Like, it's kind of like, uh, like any other Marth player. Like, low-key. Low-key or top tier. Uh, people, there's always a lot of conversation. Who is better, Marth or Corrin? Um, I feel like in this instance, if you play it right, Corrin's technically better because of the tip range that yeah. Corrin possesses. Uh, but there's MK Leo. There is MK Leo. Yeah, uh, he proves everybody wrong and says uh, Marth is better. He does have a corn he's working on. If you look at, watch some Mega Smash Mondays, um, he does have a pretty solid corn. Really? Yep. He, I'm pretty sure that's probably why the tip it. is just so intense with corn. That's, and they are similar. Yeah, they Luc are. You know, uh, Marth, Lucina, corn. Mm -hmm. I think one of the of things ways. with uh, the corn that I love about them is the fact that the range in which corn possesses is giant. No, when she Ford throws smash. it out, no one really pays attention. Oh, it's a good, um, 
bait air dodge bait option. You oh, just yeah. do a tomahawk instead of a grab, you forward smash and bait out the air dodge. And they think they have enough space to get away. Oh yeah. And just right there, if you notice, Cosmos only stayed in that shield for a little bit longer because a lot of people would get out of shield, but that last frame of Bayo's dash can still juggle you. And a lot of people don't know that, but it's insane of how like long Bayo's moves are. Chasing him, Cosmos. Ooh. Just that back safe, here. safe pressure. Ooh, trying to go for the pin. <laughs> the, the, the early kill. <laughs> <laughs> Once you hit 60, you better be afraid. <laughs> oh, and they almost had him there. That would have been beautiful. Get some off stage. Still trying to go with the tips. Get that kill. Thought he was gonna get him. That, uh, that was a nice read from Jeff. Knowing that he was bail, going to bail. that way. Ooh, cross up back here. I think Cosmos might have to change his tactic. If he's going to go to that second part of that ledge and do that, he's going to have to come up with a better option. Jeff seems to be I mean, the Dragon Pin is a great option to mix up your get up. Oh, yeah. Is he going to go for it? Oh. Says, no, not today. Not today. I don't think she can handle that. Oh, so, uh, and everybody's up there. the up air. I love that move. Ooh, misses the shield grab. Does not die from it though. Right. See, I love how that works so well, and it has so many options that you can chain together. Did he mean to do that? That juke dragon pin? I purposely missed the dragon pin tomahawk to grab. Did you see that? Yeah, I. I feel like that's just perfect right that's there. <laughs> I don't I don't know if he meant to do that. Uh, it seemed uh, hey, we're just gonna it. say he's just godlike and just do it. <laughs> Ooh, almost. That was nice. Oh the and tip! There it is. Wow, that didn't kill. That was kinda surprising. Oh, oh. Ooh, and well, the then, reversal. But that will kill. Oh, yeah. Great, yeah. It's like a lot of Fire Emblem characters do that. If you see a high percent, you're you're hunting for a lot of these easy kills. Yep. Spaced out aerials. Um, Cause I do it with Mark. If I get a good fair tip at 70, you're going somewhere. <laughs> oh yeah. Um, a good um, set to watch was. One of the Smash Factors versus MK Leo and Mr. R. Oh. And literally MK Leo, when he did that grand final set, every single one of his kills was a tipper aerial, and he killed him so early. It, it is a little bit old; uh, it's over a year old, but still, it's a it's a prime example to see um, the benefits Marth has in the precise. Oh yeah, uh, and I think that's one of the things that a lot of people underrate when it comes to certain things. Uh, I do personally like Lucina for consistency. Oh, oh wow. wow. Nice little read Wow, roll. that was some uh, serious knockback. Oh, that was great. That weapon, though. And then, it's uh, like a chainsaw sword. Has Cosmos even uh, lost the game? No, I think he's been in the winner's bracket even in his pools this Let's whole see. time. I wonder, yeah, I wonder if he's even lost the game at all this whole tournament. All right, he is uh, throwing out a secondary. What do you think it is, Lucas? I feel like Lucas is a good bet. Um, I he think does have a I really think good Sleepy. Bet. Yeah, Sleepy told me he had a Lucas. Um, I think I saw it like in a friendlies uh, like, while we were waiting. I think I saw the Lucas, and it was. Yep, yep, there it Lucas. is. Um, Jeb, the frog. 
Is that a frog on his shirt? It is or indeed. A, sorry, okay. um, Lucas is a weird character. A um, lot harder than Ness. A techn a very technical. A lot, there's a lot of debate which one's better. Personally, if you're solo maining, I think Lucas is the better character. Um, but really, the results don't back it up. Mo more potential, I think. Yeah. I usually, uh, I prefer Ness over Lucas, in my opinion. Um, mostly not just the, wow. He is on a going, rampage. Let's he's see like, I'm if, going in. Let's see I'm if Jeb there. is, uh, oh, oh, oh. contemplating. Cosmos is playing. He got him, he's hungry. All right, there. three. <laughs> Man! I don't uh, I think this is more of a desperation thing. Oh, yeah. I think he was doing fine with Bayo. He was. Yeah. Um, but I think, I think he, he just needed some change. Maybe he just wasn't feeling Bayo in this matchup currently. The bear. Trailing in for second. Oh. Get some! Man, making me eat it, my words big it, time. It, he, may, uh, uh, he may have made a good choice because the choice for, oh, and Cosmos it up. responds with a pen. <laughs> oh, he knew he was going for him after that. Oh, and he just knew exactly what to he do. Was, yeah, he's just like, I'm just going to go back to the center stage. Stage uh, control is key. His reaction time, just safe pressure. If I miss it, I'll just go back. Exactly. The last thing you want from a earthbound character such as Ness or even Lucas is to give them stage control. If you give them stage control, they have so many options to keep them keep you at bay. Those combo strings. They're so sexy. And as you saw there, Cosmos is very safe. If he misses the pin, he goes away. And that's usually a really good Yeah, uh, personally I think Corn does really good against um, Ness and Lucas. Oh yeah. Um, Personally, yes. You can just juggle. Once she's in the air, you can just juggle the bejeebus out of them. Yeah, especially and with that range that yeah. that Corrin has, it's really intense. And like we were just talking about, oh, what? he was about to steal it Wonder right if he there could. with a stage spike. Ooh, and is that it? Nope, he will survive. Ooh. <laughs> he is okay. YOLO and he does he's, not care. He's trying hardcore. He's saying, I want to get my grand finals money. Let's see. Uh, and that's and gonna be that And that will seal it for Cosmos taking winner's Let's finals see. against Jeff. Keeping it, it was a 30 and a handshake, but it was competitive. It was. It was still competitive, Let's especially see. in that last game. Yeah. I feel he's like throwing up his ha hands in there. He's like, eh, try. Yeah, I, I had a big fun time. I'm Come living the dream. Oh, there's a smile. I love it. All right, we got Colonies and Sylvanas. These uh, these two partnered up. They did. Let's they see. did indeed. Uh, Corrin, um, I feel like Jeb made a good choice, though. He definitely uh, did some work with uh, Lucas. One of the best things to do with Ness or Lucas is to really, I know as you can say, spike them better. Like what you we were just about to see. Early. Oh yes, they, you can gimp them really easily um, with those two characters. Oh, um, Sylvanas is a Lucas as well. Yes. Right. Yes, he does. Um, so I wonder how he feels. I, I feel like these guys play all the time. They're both oh. in the same region. I mean, I mean, they, they probably go to weeklies or monthlies even yeah. all the time. They fi constantly fight each other. That's sure. usually the tough part is when you know that you're fighting somebody that you've fought millions of times, they know your games inside and out, they know your tactics, it's tough. It, it, um, it adds an extra dimension to it. It does. Yeah. It adds like that okay. that fourth wall. That I mean, you're, you're thinking, I normally do this, but he knows I normally do this, exactly. so I'm going to do that. Exactly. You, you kind of have to, at that point, when you know you've fought an opponent so many times, you have to know your characters. You, and you have to own your, you have to know your own habits. Yes. And what you have you to do. acknowledge them. Let's see. You have to acknowledge them, accept them, and be like, okay, I do this, I gotta break it. He knows I do this, and he knows I get away with it. I might as well try and change it up a little bit. I'm gonna change it up. Like, I feel like at this point, if, they, if that's the case, I notice a lot of times he does a lot. When he gets a grab, it's always casual for a fox to do a down throw. 
But I feel like at the same time, you can also do a lot with the up throw. Change it up a little bit. Is this a buttons check? Uh, yeah. Uh, something's going on with the controllers. Might, this is the second time this has happened to him. Yeah. When we were playing each other, same thing happened to him. Okay. This is going to be interesting because uh, Collins has been making a good run with amongst different types of matchups. See if he can make Sylvanas another one for me too. And see he knows to take care of it. He knows, he knows Sylvanas' games. We're just saying they know each other. I mean, this is loser Simi right now. And uh, they probably have watched each other, studied each other during this whole competition. And uh, they probably know their shenanigans and games by this point. And again, Mewtwo is just such a great area, great spacing, great aerials. The down is a really them safe out. bet. Yeah. But just Colony's throwing out those burst options. Sylvanas kind of picked that up. Ooh, I don't know. That might have been it if he connected with that fair. So far, it's looking strong for Sylvanas. Oh, shined it back and said, "Take your shadow ball out of here." In Smash Four, we use the reflector for reflect. <laughs> <laughs> Not just running up on melee people and just shining. <laughs> Ooh, oh, man. and the back here oh. killed. Okay. Yeah, he's a light one. He's big and light. Oh, oh, and, and returning the favor. Sylvanas, once again. He just whips his, whips his tail. He said, get up there. We're going to make this a... even. Already putting 36% on Colonies. Ooh. Colonies is making a quick comeback on that. Oh, with, with how light Mewtwo is and... Fox's burst options and his vortex stuff. Um, it's no wonder he gets those. Yeah, it, it, really you know he's always in the mindset of if he's at 300% last stock and they're at 99 stocks. I firmly believe that Colony's is so confident he can take thinks he can take it. Oh yeah. And Colony is I know this calling him out where yeah. he where he is in the air. Because Colony is, while Sabanus was trying to do fairs, he was not only coming from the front, went behind him, and then made him juggle him even further to get up to that 115% that he has currently. Oh, oh, that fair? Nope. Does not kill, Whoa. but that Shadow Ball could have. Oh, wow. That was nice. That was, that was a great firefox. So far, it's a very Sylvanas good Sylvanas is so good with covering options with everything that Shadow Ball. Cover the side B option. Oh, yeah. And Colonies <laughs> knew that. Colonies knew that, and that's why he went down to that firebox. Oh, yeah. Because all it. Oh. Uh, and that's that it. will give it to Sylvanas on game one against Colonies. How do you feel about it? I didn't look. You think? Uh, kind of a mini upset, isn't it? Huh? Co Colonies yeah. Is, yeah. is typically. Um, I don't, I, I don't know. I've never time. seen these. This is not my region, so yeah. I don't know um, how these sets normally go. Yeah, like, when it comes to Colonies, I've watched plenty of sets with him. Um, and same thing, you know, uh, plenty of other players that we're fighting today. Uh, I specifically follow Colonies um, because I love watching Fox players. Larry yeah. Lur is one of my favorites. Um, love watching him. And What's another one? A Snoofle? A Smash and Splash? Did you watch him? He didn't make it very far, yeah. but but um, he really impressed me with just, you know. Oh! That would have been hype. Oh! oh! Get some! Spiked uh, him right uh, in and called him out and said no. And uh, we've, we've seen not him doing lead. that. All, all top eight, we've seen him doing that. And uh, he finally connects. That's all it takes. That one nice sweetness right there. Stacking up that damage. Getting that neutral. Oh! oh hype! Spike! And that will <laughs> take game two for Sylvanas in a very, very quick set. Sylvanas is going to have to He's digging turn right around. Now. He's digging deep. Sylvanas just. They play each other so much. I think Sylvanas is just getting a hold on them. 
feel like more. Um, okay, so we have a, another uh, name change. So I've possibly seen possibly another character change. What? Uh, I've seen him go chic sometimes. Really? Uh huh. I can't. I like the question mark. Let's see. Am I colonies? Uh, who else does it use? I think it's Sheik. I want to guess the Sheik. My if hypothesis. It is Sheik, it makes sense why he changed that from Smash to Attack. Because to get those stairs out really quick. Yeah. You too. Oh. Wow. I stand corrected. So, most likely just going for the up airs. Make a flick of the C stick. Definitely makes it you know, nice. The the cloud stuff. You know, we haven't seen much clouds in this top eight. Lots of bales. Yes, lots of bales. But you know, deep down, they all have cloud backups. Yes, okay. All pocket. of them have cloud backups. You seen the you seen the pocket cloud shirts? Yes. They're pretty hilarious. Because <laughs> <laughs> it's true. That's <laughs> the pocket cloud coming out. Let's see how it is. Oh, oh my goodness! Those he knows exactly what to do against this character. Disabled mid-air, kept the combo going, made sure he did not TI out of that. One of my favorite things that I watch in Mewtwo is the neutral air. Neutral air is such a good move. Probably one of my personal oh, favorites in the game. He's uh, taking a no step from Sylvanas' book. Dare it up, baby. Ooh, and got an up smash on colonies. Oh man. Get that shadow ball up and running. <laughs> I have them all for you. Oh, no punish. Okay. It keeps hitting him with that neutral air. And he keeps eating it. Oh, in the cloud. Oh, Doing the cloud. The cloud. Oh, that was that was shit. Oh, that was hype. Ooh, Making me eat my words that. again. Oh, Did you see that? That was neutral air to reverse flip neutral air. Mm -hmm. That was and, so cool. I think it was a uh, back air too at the very end to make him just all of a sudden get that That's set for the uh, side B. Yeah. But we've seen many times where even though they get lose a stock, they answer right back. Yep. Like this, they answer right back and makes it even. Savannah's in match point right now. Set point, that's my, my bad. Um, Let's see if this cloud can pull through. There's plenty of pocket clouds. Oh, I wonder if he could have nared right after that for a frame trap option. I think he could at the very yeah. end of that. Yeah. <laughs> Oh man. Okay. That was true. Oh, I know it's not. Went for the Is he going for it? Taking a play out of his uh, Fox's book. That's one thing I love about this game. Even though you may have a set, like motion and process for a certain character, you can mix and match those yeah. processes with so many other characters and reinvent a character's play style. Exactly. And, oh, that does not kill, but. Savannah's in a tight spot right now. Very still, tight spot. Uh, still not it. Oh, and man, that will was... close game three. Let's see. <laughs> Sylvanas is like, yeah, I can never escape the pocket cloud. All right, so we got colonies taking his first game in this set. Um, Sylvanas dropped the ball a little bit on the last game. Kind of, I think he got a little yeah, last too stock. greedy. Yeah, last stock, um, uh, it was kind of in his favor. I, I think he got a little too greedy. He was hunting for knowing that he's at, you know, set point and didn't expect the cloud to be a little too hungry. this way. Yeah. And that's usually what happens, you know, when you're in that situation, you get a little too hungry, but it's okay. And he is saying, he is saying, this is my set Yo. right now. Connie's answering back and uh, making sure that making gives us Sylvanas know he's still here. Starting that Fox. Shadow Ball underneath the platform. Safe. He's preparing the gifts. 
Add on, tack on that damage. That is such a cool throw. That's <laughs> yeah. literally all it's for is just to add that damage. Honestly, all of Mewtwo's moves are just so cool. It is. That's it. And like he is such a cool character too. That's when he even gets eliminated, he just like folds his yeah. arms like, okay. Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm six foot seven and two hundred sixty pounds, but I'm one of the lightest characters in the game. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's, it's like, it's, it's like okay. It's uh. Good choice, Good I choice. guess. Nintendo. <laughs> Sakurai says I gotta stay consistent with him in melee, I guess. <laughs> oh. I wonder if he could have finishing touch there. Could have. So, like... um, our Columbus Tio, Keast, he mains uh, Cloud, and he, he uses the classic controller. Okay. Um, and it, it, he has this uh, play style where he almost never runs, he'll walk. So. And he no, used to be ca walk? yeah he just walks and um, oh he used to be Captain Falcon but when Cloud came out he made the switch and it's it was like, even oh, funnier it was even funnier with Captain Falcon you know his walking animation but but anyways he'll do the finishing touch so much that we've actually coined a uh, term in the Columbus office when he does it yeah or the, the Columbus area it's the uh, gentle touch <laughs> he just yeah. walks up and does his little flip. Doing the gentle touch. <laughs> <laughs> the gentle Don't That's worry, it. I ain't going to be too aggressive. That's it. <laughs> That's it. Hey, it packs no. a punch though when it hits. <laughs> <laughs> so Sylvana is taking That's the it. first stop in game four. Looking That's very it. dominating. That's oh my goodness. He the up smash. He knows. He's fa he, he's uh he's not falling for any of Colony's like little shenanigans that he has for himself. Yeah. Um, I feel like all DLC characters though have shenanigans of their own. And uh oops. tried to make that a ball. Air. He's making sure he's getting ready to throw him up to the heavens. Was it looking grim for colonies? See, I'm holding up. on to his first stop. Ooh. Get some! That's how you end it in That's a shiny it. way. And Sylvanas with a thumbs up, <laughs> saying, I approve. I, I approve. just won the set. Uh, that face right there, Mewtwo's making. He should run for president for that. See. You should vote for me. Um, maybe. Yeah. You're not 35. Let's see. <laughs> <laughs> look, look Let's at Mewtwo's see. face. Let's see. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. <laughs>